Words by Barbara Simons We all have our demons to shed. These demons are negative ballast that keeps us securely anchored, buoyant yet strategically submerged into the waters of duality, knowing good from evil. A ship must have sufficient weight or balance in the hull to keep it able to float, yet not tip. That is how we maintain our equilibrium in this dimension, by the dense energy we attract and house. It is time to release the old fears that have kept us anchored in this sea, this environment of eating from the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. It is time to challenge those things that bring discomfort to our soul. It is time to question long-held dogma. It is time to open the door so that light may come flooding in. It's time to step boldly into this new area of consciousness that allows us, with divine guidance, to overcome the many adversaries in our consciousness. We have so many that lie in the heart of our being that must be overcome. These adversaries keep us in restriction until we recognize them and call them out. Rituals, practices, worship, and paying tithes to institutional gods all must have their time in the sun to be recognized for what they are. We must become inner landscape architects and strategists, listening to the voice of our own intuition, honing that skill until we hear the command to clear the land of formerly held beliefs and strongholds within the mind. These strongholds and egregores are embedded in our consciousness and are linked to our physical bodies. As we clear, we must occupy the land consciously. As you change your thinking, your whole being body, soul, and spirit will change. We will release the ballast that anchors us in this dimension, and we will arise. Be brave, sojourner. Be brave. Barbara Simons, author of Escaping Christianity, Finding Christ, and Musings from an Ex-Christian Fundamentalist.